Lots of good uh, stuff. There also, are also like eleven-hour movies people have put together that are really well done. Right, that are like super cuts of the, uh, of uh, of the different uh, of the different cutscenes. So my question to you uh-huh. and to the chat: Are you ready to go on a wild ride? Oh, I'm ready. So this is my favorite Easter egg in all of Metal Gear Solid. Oh God. So you see how we've got two two cameras here set up. I've probably described this to you, so you probably know where it's going. Mm-hmm. But basically, you can walk up here and. Hit the button. They keep hitting the button. They keep looking. What? Wait, it gets better. Don't rest a little. Stop. Hold on, I should probably hide. This is not how I wanted this to go. I'm still in. I just wait for it. This might might have messed something up. Maybe. So I'm gonna let this go. Because I don't want it to be... Oh, my God. Broken. Fish cones are everywhere. I'm terrified. At ease. Rest a little while. Move on. Okay. I think we Metal might be good. Metal Gear Ray as Amphibious. Okay. Twitch chat, I, I, I swear I'm going to look at more, but I, I never, absolutely never knew Here we you could go. do this. So you hit it enough, and Snake gets curious. She's like, what does this button do? And everyone looks at that instead of the, the commander. What in the world is this? So you hit the button again, and it's like, oh, it's over here. Just to make sure that you know that they're looking at not the commander. I don't even understand. <laughs> this is this is Metal Gear for me. Like, <laughs> sure, you know, anti-nuclear proliferation. I can't pronounce that word. Uh, but this, this, like, it's so dumb. Do we know who that is? It's just a random AV idol. Like, Kojima, like, probably just was like, this is a video I like. It's on my hard drive. Take it. <laughs> oh, now we've got two of them. What the What does that mean? Where do we look? <laughs> like, We're I don't so know confused. what to do. Which one do I like more? Yo, this is weird. We hit a button. Oh, wait a minute. Who did that? <laughs> and you literally get a game over because they're so upset at you. <laughs> this is my, my favorite, favorite Easter egg. It's, ugh. It's so good. You know, it's so funny, too, because you think about it, right? And all we hear these days are about development cycles and how expensive it is and, like, every little thing. You're like, wouldn't it be cool if they did this? And they're like, no, it just, you know, costs money. Like, we'd love it if we could do everything. But, like, you know, we just can't do it. We don't have time for it. And then it's like you've got these games. And, look, does that add, like, value to the gameplay? No. no. And, like, you know, I... It's not some again. Like I'm not a I'm not a, someone who cares about Easter eggs that much, but it's like just the idea that they've made they've got that when a developer goes to this length to make their world interactive, even in a silly way. Yeah, it, like it's it's totally it has nothing to do with anything. It's stupid. It's pointless, but it's in there, and it, it makes it more fun. And there's kind of like a cool little little thing if you you spend the time to find it out. Yeah,